Hello, hola, mabuhay, crazy abangers! It's me again, your ultimate pageant buddy. I'm Ati Bang, 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 bang. Hello and mabuhay! For today's video, guys, uh, for the final stretch of Miss World Video Reaction, I want to give uh, a feature and a highlight to our own uh, representative for Miss World 2022. From the Philippines, of course, we have Tracy Maureen Perez as she vibe for the title of Miss World 2022. So let's watch this video that she posted on Instagram. And also I wanna share to you my reactions, my opinions, and my thoughts about her. So I will not keep you waiting, but before that, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell to so get notified. Every time I have a new Okay guys, let's get started. So, if you don't have any idea guys, the Philippines is very prone to typhoon. I think we have like uh, more than 50 in a year, if I'm not mistaken. So. In this video, we are watching a typhoon incident in the Visayas region. So, okay, I'm a bit emotional, so I'm trying to uh, be composed while watching this video. So see, this is, uh, we always hit by typhoon and yes. It's really difficult and but Filipinos are always um, strong we are resilient we never give up we always stand uh, once more so with all these trials and struggles that we are facing in the Philippines because of typhoon we are never giving up super typhoon adept one of the strongest and most destructive typhoons in Philippine history had hit my hometown, Cebu. I woke up to the news that my friends and family's homes, including ours, were greatly affected. And Cebu was completely devastated, leaving the island with no water. And so this is uh, Miss Tracy Maureen Perez um, in Cebu. So... Electricity. I wanted to do something. I needed to help them. And so I started spreading the news to the world and started a small campaign in my own little way. When I finally got back home to Cebu this month of March, I made sure to visit my hometown and help her I can. With the aid of like-minded people who have good hearts, we were able to cover three communities in barangays of 100 families and prioritize the single mothers to somehow help them get back to their families. My commitment to uplift the lives of single mothers cannot be stopped by any typhoon or disaster. You can feel the genuineness of Tracy Marine Paris as I have uh, shared on my social media. Uh, it took six years for her to be to be in that position and to finally win the Miss World crown. And if you can see her crowning moment, she fell on the stage for some few times, I think three times. And she joined so many pageants because this is really what she wants and she really wants to have that platform to help uh, the Filipino people, especially the single mom. So 
it's a really inspiring story and what i love about uh, tracy marine paris this is not just for publicity and this is just not for the competition but you can feel that she's so sincere um it is so natural for her to help i think um everything that we are watching right now is her true identity i mean on screen off screen Tracy Marine Paris is Tracy Marine Paris. So if I will be asked if who will be my Miss World 2022, I will be very happy and proud to say that Tracy Marine Paris deserves the crown this time because of her not uh, never giving up attitude, her determination, her heart more than more than her physical beauty. So I hope that uh, the Miss World organization, Miss Julia Morley, can see it. I know that there are a lot, many, many beautiful um, contestants in the top 40, and it's so tough. But for me, winning the crown for, for, for the Philippines is, it's such a big deal. I think all her hard work will pay it off. So let's keep on watching, guys. about her is just not give, giving up right and her love to her mom it's unconditional she's a miracle baby and her mom supported her she has her single mom and I know her mom in heaven is so proud of of what she's doing her charity works and all her achievements so I just really wish that she will win the crown this time Para kay nanay, patuloy akong magsisilbi. For my mother, I will always be of service. Aww. Yes, I watch her um, Beauty with a Purpose. And it is a project that was... Um, it was created and founded personally because she experienced it you know more than more than beauty with a purpose project it is really her cause and her advocacy she really want to help and uh, yes let's see on march 16th who's going to win um i'm sharing this not only because i'm a filipino you can watch my other vlogs guys that i'm trying my best not to be uh not to be biased but i think this time tracy marine paris is such a strong um candidate for the crown and miss world is on it's really unpredictable you don't know who's going to win so for us filipinos we have one crown for the miss world and if we will be given the chance to win another crown um, through uh, Tracy Marin Paris, we are proud. But of course, um, this is a competition. So whoever wins, we are going to be very happy and we are going to congratulate whoever the winner is. So good luck, guys. And I hope um, we will still cheer for each other. And... For the comment section below, let me know where are you from. Tell me who do you think will win the Miss World and why. Okay, so this is my vlog. I hope you like, share, and comment. And if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell to so get notified every time I have a new upload. See you again soon. Bye and mabuhay.